here we are with a Zendikar pre-release sealed. I'm super excited to do this. I'm doing a voice, voice narration with this right now because I was not able to talk and holy crap, look at that. Rampaging Baelor. That's pretty good, right? And then a crappy rare like Predatory Urge and Archive Trap. And this land that lets you take an extra turn. So I'm guessing most people are thinking, oh, we should go blue, but uh, those are definitely not cards to go blue as well. So. Those are really good uh, other cards though, so we're definitely going green. So let's check out what else we got here. Uh, our white is really subpar. Actually, it doesn't look good at all. I don't believe we'll even consider white, although we do have the core Skyfishers, which is a really good card. And it's just a beating the half, but we'll go ahead and uh, add the green. We know we're gonna play. And these are for sure playables. War Chandler's a really solid card. It can get rid of anything. If they're stuck on lands, they can kill it. If they got an artifact, they can get rid of it. Bail off is really good. Cobra Trap can be pretty good. Get you into four snakes. Um, so we'll go ahead and add that. That card's a very bad card for playing with that. Cards okay if you have an ally deck. And here's my friend. And I'm gonna complain to him about how he only got like two good rares. One of them's worth probably about six. Let's check out the land over here. Alright, so let's look at black. Black looks really solid with all of this. Look at this. Giant Scorpion, Vampire Nighthawk, Crip Ripper, which is so good. And two Needle Bite Traps, which I am not a fan of, I don't think. So conditional, and if you miss or look, gaining life and you don't play it, you really just kind of lose. Here's our blue. Over here, we got one, two playables maybe. Consider adding another mole chandler. It's the only black we have right now. Let's look at artifacts, nurturing gear, black again. We want to splash red for these two cards, burst lightning. Actually, I'm looking at the red right now. Looking at the playables. It may be a playable, it may be a playable. Yeah, Rift's definitely in. Mark Muni can get there. Slaughter Cry, definitely good. Torchlinger's definitely good. Another Torchlinger's good. Demolish, you know, I put there. Pyromancer. <clears throat> Definitely good with the allies. And Lava Ball Trap. Another subpar rare that you don't want to open in a sealed. So red looks pretty good. Looks even a little better right now than a, a black. For this side it does right now. Let's, let's add this red. This is playable. So we got the teetering peaks. A lot of good red. But we only got uh, three more playables. So we're going to need to add. Some other green cards. Savage Silhouette's a good green card. Look at some Scythe Tiger. That guy's really good. And another 
red card. Three four two two is just not that exciting. Got our Zendikar lands first. I really want to add in the Sap Silhouette. Putting that at the 5 drop because that's kind of where it should be. Card. We could add the allies for our Pyromancer. Let's count them up. We got one ally. And really, it's not worth it. So I'm just going to get rid of it. That card's pretty bad. We might as well play the mongrel over the, uh, the cat. Because it's 3 3 for, uh, or a 2 2 for 3, but the mongrel has other abilities. And I really want Haro, because Haro is just a beating if you have landfall. And that's what uh, I'm complaining about over there. I'm saying, ah, oh, I never get Haro in my seals. Because if I had Haro, I'd probably go three color or something. And that's so good with Rampage and Gale. You get that stick, and then you play Haro. It's just a fun time. So I'm pretty sure I'm still trying to figure out one, one more card to play. I kind of want to play um, maybe the local community. Maybe get there. I don't. I don't want to play Lava Ball Trap. It's so conditional. It's 8 mana. It deals 4 damage to your creatures as well. So I start looking at other um, cards here. Hmm. Scythe Tiger. Kind of blows yourself out if you play maybe a 2-2. Got two allies here in the form of these cats. So you can add it, but it's still really not worth it. And here's a savage silhouette, which is really, really good card. Regenerates really powerful. So, we'll add that in, and I'll be what we look at for right now. Let's add some land. Let's see if there's a Jeff. 